Susie went to the supermarket to buy groceries. After parking her car and adjusting her hat, she stepped out into the street. It was early morning, so there were very few people around. But right by the supermarket's entrance, Susie saw a dog tied up. A small one, and a very beautiful one. The dog sat calmly, as if trying to deliberately show its patience. But it was clear that it wasn't comfortable being in such a still position. Like all young dogs, it clearly loved to run around. Susie really liked this cute dog, she wanted to pet it. But she didn't do it, because it's rude to approach other people's animals. She just smiled at the dog and went about her business. When Susie came out of the store, a whole half hour had passed, the dog was sitting in the same spot. Its gaze was fixed on something in the distance. Susie took a closer look and realized that an old woman was walking in that direction, who was already quite far away, but her silhouette could still be seen. The dog was watching this woman. Susie frowned. It didn't look like the owners were in a hurry to pick up their dog. They must have lingered in the store longer than they originally intended. After thinking for a moment, the girl decided to wait for the dog to be collected. She didn't want to leave the animal in this strange, unsafe position. She got into the car and continued to watch. I'll wait for 15 minutes, then I'll ask them to call its owners at the store. You can't torture a dog like this for so long, Susie decided. But that much time wasn't needed, the situation was resolved much sooner. That old woman, whom the dog was watching, suddenly came back. Susie had never seen elderly women run at such a speed before. The grandmother ran up to the dog, and it rushed towards her, pulling on the leash. I've gone completely mad, I forgot about you. Oh, you old wreck. Forgive me. The woman cried out as she untied the dog. She was clearly blaming herself for how carelessly she had acted. The dog was very happy to have its owner back. It barked and rubbed against her legs. The old woman came out of the store and simply walked past. Anyone would be scared, of course, now he was happy, because he wasn't left there forever after all. Susie was relieved. Realizing that everything was fine, she drove home. She felt happy and warm. 